that one dude was claiming that Goodman was better than Train in every way. Yeah, and this way too, buddy. Cheap, flimsy ABS plastic on a thin beer can thick lid with a piece of stupid uh, cut gray electrical conduit. Now you got a wedge back in here. I don't even know how the fuck that came off. I'm not even, I, I'm about to mess with that now just to get that piece of junk together just because I wanted to inspect the fan that's wobbling because it's chintzy two-year-old unit. Everything that Goodman orders from vendors, they must low spec it to fit their budget because this these fan blades, I mean, if you sneeze, you sneeze on this, it's going to freaking either break or bend. I mean, it's so delicate, so chintzy, so flimsy in every way. And I swear, like the motors in the past, I was brown charges. I swear to get the motors down to the price that Goodman was willing to pay. Because they were getting motors from GE and Emerson and everything, just like everybody else. But they would leak oil so bad. <laughs> it's like, they must be leaving out seals, the manufacturers, to bring them down to the cost that Goodman wanted or something. <laughs> I don't know if that's literally true, but it's like, makes you wonder. Because, uh two three-year-old Goodman's man all the motors would be covered with oil the whole sides of them just in the same manufacturers making the motors that were in carrier and, and train and uh, not nearly wearing so bad chintzy ass piece of garbage I'm trying to get this freaking conduit to go back in that hole thinking that surely that conduit doesn't just hang by the wires right uh yeah that's exactly what it does on a piece of shit Goodman oh, there's other unit Look, this one flops around too. I just took that one apart over there because I wanted to make sure the fan blade wasn't bent. But look at this stuff. It's just flimsy. This is this is not train quality. Sorry, dude. One thing I wish Goodman would not have copied Carrier on is using these silly freaking washers that fall off every time, and you got to go chase them across the rooftop. They suck. <laughs> That sounded choice. Piece of junk, Goodman. So I just had to use my angle grinder to cut this outer part of the bearing off because look at that, it wore right down where the set screw was. <laughs> it wore that shaft a little bit and guess what? They don't have a shaft, they don't have a blower assembly, they don't have none of that because they suck. It's almost a new unit, two year old unit. And they don't even have parts for it. They have one bearing in town for it. What a piece of junk. So now the only way I could get this running is if I could loosen the shaft and just shift it over a little bit so I could get on some good meat. What a piece of junk. Oh yeah, by the way, these screws popped out too. And I was talking to my brother-in-law. He said, and he, before I even mentioned it, he goes, oh yeah, they use little screws and they're always popping to hold the blower down. He says, and they're always popping loose and the belt's flopping around. It's just probably what takes out the bearings piece of shit all right just had to put this piece of junk back together the bearing failed hardcore <laughs> ground the shaft down a little bit so i had to move the shaft around and the goodman distributors had no parts they had one bearing in stock in the valley and uh nothing else i wanted a whole complete blower <laughs> assembly and then even have that think as often as these pieces of junks break they would have parts in stock but the guy at the Goodman distributor had a hard time even looking up the parts for this POS but yeah and I had to sell, use a self tapper and drill a new hole over here to get that and I'll probably be busted free next time I come here piece of junk I can't believe that's so chintzy the way this screws down it's, it's all with those little with these little screws right here this is what's holding <laughs> the blower assembly into the unit and there's tension because of the wheel, so it wants to lift that up. And it's only held down with two of those. Two of those. Which has come loose on pretty much every one of these. Piece of junk. Gosh. Can't believe anybody thinks this stuff matches the quality of Train or Lennox. You guys are smoking crack. Not just marijuana, you must be smoking crack.